I mean, it's broke no matter what. It's yeah. done. Um, the only thing is, is that's, I, I don't know what you... holds. I don't know what holds that in place. There's just a little spot between there, but I don't know how that's set up. I just know that they they talk about it, so I don't well, know it's how a, it's set it's in. It's a slip yoke. Okay. But uh, what I'm worried about is if I kill the the splits, they might be shot already. The yeah, splines right. where they slide mm -hmm. on. If uh, I keep, I don't. I don't think it'll come apart. Right. I don't think so either. Right now it's held. It's kind of holding itself. Right. But if we separate it, I don't know. I don't know how that how that's done. I don't know if there's a little drive line in there. I well, the yokes are bolted that. in. Okay. So you should be able to remove the drive line. Just remove that section out. Yeah. Just take the just take the drive line out of it. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to another 208 Adventures. We're uh, up behind Mackie, Idaho, a little bit southwest. So we uh, kind of peeled up behind there and uh, jumped off one of the mine tour roads. And we're going to head up behind the reservoir, see how that works out. And uh, kind of run over by Copper Basin. And uh, as you can see at the beginning of the video, we had some uh, complications with the, one of the machines. So Randy Yamaha kind of had some issues. But no big deal, they all do. It's just a, just a matter of time. So I know he's had, I had what close to 4,000 miles on that machine, has never had to do anything to it. Uh, it's been super reliable. So uh, it's kind of wild this, this happened where it did. Uh, and you'll see that um, could have been a lot worse. There were some uh, narrow spots on the trail before we even got to that point. And uh, it's a good thing it didn't break up there. That would have been a tough one. But uh, anyway, all good. So you see here we're kind of coming down off the mountain. Pretty windy day. Um, but it, was, it was beautiful. The weather was nice. And uh, if you get up here and top this lookout or this radio tower, you'll hear the wind just flat whipping. Um, but anyway, watch the video. Enjoy. If you guys haven't subscribed, you know, please consider. Um, it sure helps us out. We appreciate it. And again, enjoy the video.
think, I think we got tools. I think. I got, I got, I got a toolbox here too. You got enough tools? Myself. Yeah. I. Ten millimeter ratchet. I think. I'm gonna put on my little surgical gloves. Hang on. Snap. Okay, <laughs> Randy. Yes, <laughs> yeah, he is. <laughs> See that? No. Look at. Right. <laughs> <laughs> really, it's not that bad. Little trail maintenance. <laughs> it's not that bad. That's what they not all that say. good either. That's what they all say at first. <laughs> oh God. Unload Tracy's garage. <laughs> You're jugging the trees. There. I just have water. <laughs> Looks like a keg to me. Kind of is. <laughs> Pony keg? Yeah. <laughs> of water. You know, have you noticed later in the day she doesn't get out and walk around much? Water. <laughs> water. <laughs> that clear. With a little out. blend. <laughs> What's the matter for you? Yeah, I think second gear and you can see that drive line going into the rear diff. It just pop, 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 pop. But as soon as you locked it in four, that quit it because it locked that whole system from going. But Isn't that weird that it broke on that flat spot right there? It didn't break coming down the hill or going up a hill. Just taking it easy. Bang. I got more stuff that'll, if you that'll, need it. That'll teach you, Randy. <laughs> Should stick with what you know, full yeah. send. Drive it like this, <laughs> stole it, Randy. <laughs> There you go, try to take it easy on stuff and this is what happens. Did you want any of these bolts saved or you want me to just throw them in the dirt? <laughs> I would really appreciate it if you <laughs> saved them. It would have been a lot better if you could have done it further up on the hill. I know. Well, it was really narrow. We're in the shade. Oh, I was just gonna pull that shield off. Right better, you gotta you get the. Um, there's a break there, and then from there it goes into the transmission. It's getting in between there anyway. There's a coupling, and it sets it. It's, co it's common for them to go out. They'll they'll blow. You're talking about the slip yoke, right? I guess I don't know. I think everybody calls it a coupling or something. At least what I thought I heard. But I could be making some shit up. Forget that. <laughs> you know what these player owners are. <laughs> Just make shit up. Consistent. As long as it sounds good. You believe it? Yeah. I ain't saying shit because he's the only MacGyver we got here. <laughs> Watch you guys go down those hills. I mean, you guys weren't touching the brakes at all. I watched your back tires just sitting there sliding. Yeah. And you weren't on the brakes at all. That's pretty cool. A couple times, I mean, but you were just slowing down some stuff. That was... Yeah, you could hear them dragging a little, sliding. Is this, is this going to take very long? <laughs> I hope not. Yeah, I just. <laughs> I don't have that much ice. <laughs> <laughs> So, it's, so it's, it's, I think I think where you're at. Grab that thing and wiggle it, Randy. The, well, I, I gotta take the cover off. No, nah, you can get the bot, not that one, the bottom one. That, that one. one. So you're even back here. Yep. Yeah, that That's makes, where it is. Right here. Yeah, it's all dried out and stripped out. Wow. Yeah, you got. It's right here, Randy. You can see it clear as day. In the back, back there. Yeah. Yeah, where you splined in on your differential. Yeah, that thing's that's the that's the coupling in there. I knew there was a coupling in there, but I didn't know where it was at. Yeah, and see, this is this is flange right here. This one is this one here. Yeah, but that like that other one drives your transmission. This one drives your rear diff. Yeah, and this one it does. Is that one? That's one. That's one you're you're getting to earlier. Well, we thought we needed to, but it's not. Oh, it's the yeah. wrong one. But the okay. one, the one, say, one right does here it got is the two one. of them. Yeah, <laughs> it does. It has one that comes out of the motor, runs up to the transmission. Then from yeah. the transmission, it goes to this one, 
Yep. Then splits off. Yep. Yeah, it does. that's that's so toast. It, I think you're better off leave it where it's at. Yeah. Because like, well, it's a flip yoke going into the transmission. Yeah. I think you're where you're at with it. You look back here and it's all rusty. You can see where it's probably been spitting. You know, it's like spun out, mm -hmm. and it's spitting stuff out of there. Mm. Yes. You'll have to see it on this side. It's it's pretty. You can see the rust all around that joint. The splines are all shit out. It just died. Oh, here. Deal. So yeah, right there in front of this break, you can see there's some rust and stuff around there. But anyway, when you're wiggling that, you can see that it just turns inside that. It's just spinning oh, inside this. Okay. So that's where it's those splines are out of it or however that coupling sets up. Because I thought for some reason this whole unit, the brake hooks do is a coupling, but I don't know. I just hear them talking about a coupling, but there's no way to disconnect that. Nope. Well, here is. I'll put the, the bowl back in the All right. Well, I'm going to turn this off. Seems like you guys have figured it out. Yeah, I should look at that first. I was thinking it was right here because the way this was jumping and back there. <laughs> right. It is a heck of a view. You know, yeah, that's uh, for, for those of us that are not mechanically inclined. This is a beautiful spot to have stopped and take in the scenery. I mean, That's right. Yeah. Check that out. Let the MacGyvers get her done. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> yeah, we'll stay here and enjoy what we came up here to do. <laughs>